Saints fans, we're backstage here with the second place getter for this year's Trevor Barker Award, Seb Ross. Seb, backed it up again, obviously won it last year, but another huge year this year. How is it to get second place? Yeah, look, it's something uh, I'm really proud of and um, I suppose winning it last year probably made me more determined just to, because you never want to be one of those type of players that um, sort of wins something and falls away the next year. So um, I probably had one of my biggest off seasons um, last year, I come back, run PB times um, into the pre-season, which is something I really wanted to prove to myself and prove to um, my teammates that um, I was serious about um, having real team success. And so I didn't want to come back and um, out of shape like I'd um, celebrated too hard with winning it last year. You touched on the pre-season. We've seen a lot of boys, more so than usual, back in the gym already. And we're only a few weeks after finishing. Is there a sense of sort of really resetting for next year and what, what the group I guess wanted to explode into 2019? Yeah absolutely and I think I think more than ever um, it probably burns in the guys guts a little bit I know it, it definitely does for me uh, being my seventh year and um, heading into my eighth year still having played finals so I'm, I'm more committed and more motivated than ever to um, get myself right and try and um, get the other younger boys that probably haven't been through as many off seasons as um, us older boys have, try and teach them what it's all about. But uh, yeah, I think I've, I've been in to the footy club a fair bit so, and it's great to see 10 or 12 blokes there each day sort of filtering through. Um, I, think the, I think the guys really know what this group can achieve and uh, yeah, we had a lean year this year, but I know uh, we're really confident in the year we can have next year. Seb, we saw you absolutely storm home in the second part of the year and your numbers were just absolutely huge. Do you gain a bit of confidence taking that sort of momentum into next season? Yeah, I think so. Like, uh, I probably just touched on I'm, mo I'm more motivated than ever because um, I'm not really, I'm not motivated by individual accolades or anything like that at all. I've, I've always played in team sports. I never played tennis. I never played golf. Um, I've always loved the team aspects of sport. Um, and, that, and that's all I've ever really wanted to play, to, to have that team success, get that really team camaraderie. And uh, I know I'm just really pumped for Stuv to win his fourth, Trevor Bark, which is absolutely amazing achievement. I think he's, uh, I can't remember the fella's name, who's also won four, but Rui's won six. So that's, oh no, he's ahead of guys like Robert Harvey and Lenny Hayes, guys I grew up watching thinking they were absolute stars. And now I get to play alongside one, which I'm absolutely pumped. Well, congratulations on an incredible year, Seb. All the best for 2019. Yeah, thanks, Mick.